Next up, we're going to be making the warming festive drink of... In fact, they're all warming. The warming... The festive drink of mulled wine. Now, I've come over to the large... Inc Is it Mercury Retrograde? Now, I've come over to the larger cooking area because I've got more stuff to do with this, including um, cutting an orange is the first task. So I'm going to show you down here. Let me, let me move the camera. First up, let's cut our orange into slices. Not very uh, elegant slices. Oh, well. Mama big sleeves. Oh, my God. I've been using the wrong knife. Now, the actual mulled wine I'm going to be using for this is a bottle that my friend got me and it's uh, I believe it's pronounced Glühwein. Glühwein? Is that the proper German way of saying it? Or Belgian? I don't actually know. Um, it's a massive bottle as you can see. So I won't use it all today. I mean, yeah, I'm just going to use a little bit for the purpose of this video anyway. So um, yeah, Glühwein. I just like saying Glühwein. Glühwein? Glühwein. Glühwein. Right, let's put a uh, generous glug of this in into the pan, I've got my gas on, there we go, how much should I put in? Stop, 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 oh my god, okay, glühwein. <laughs> so some other things you're going to need to plop into your pan of mulled wine, um, is all this, all your oranges, yeah, and then you've got um, your, your cinnamon stick, make sure you don't forget that, you got a whole nutmeg again. I like using whole nutmegs. Um, some cloves. Can, can you see it? cloves? Oh God! Your cloves, maybe a few cardamom pods. Um, so just make sure you just plonk all them in. Um, there you go. Let's take this down to the pan, shall we? Actually, let's just, just glide, glide down to the pan. Plop that in there. Let me just change it round. That in focus, you've got your wooden spoon, keep stirring it gently. And you go, uh, whoops, pop that in. Uh, I won't use all of these. I mean, while you're waiting for that to warm up, you might as well just suck an orange, you know. Oh. Hmm. One of your five a day. Hmm. I've got. I've got to tell you, the smell in here is amazing. It smells so festive because I'm in the greenhouse, shut the door, got the heater on. All the smells are just like ruminating in here and it just smells so festive. It's so great. Mm -hmm. Let me get my cup. I mean, look, 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 there they are. The, the aroma waves making it smell so lovely in here. The cloves, the cinnamon, the nutmeg, the orange, the mulled wine itself. The cardamom pods, it's just, it's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's great. I can't wait to get in the cup. So I think we're ready to go ahead and pour it into our cup now. So let's do that right now, shall we? One last stir. Actually, uh, actually, make me handle. I mean, what's the point in burning yourself when you actually got a handle for it? All right, so... Can you see that? Oh. Okay. Take a bit of orange. Plump that in there. There we go. Ready to go, look. I mean, look at that fabulous glass of, well, festive fabulousness, to be fair. Yeah, let's have a little sit down, shall we? So, let's take a pew now and relax and enjoy our festive drinks. Whatever festive drinks you'd like to enjoy at this time of year. Um, have a good one and um, yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Cheers.